is definitely a mod. This piece of equipment is used to find a bog turtle. It is one of the rarest turtles in North America. Craig Patterson works with the Maryland Department of Natural Resources. He is looking for a bog turtle that is carrying an antenna. Patterson says the creature must be close because sounds from the device are getting louder. More than 30 turtles are living under dirt in these few hectares of protected land. The bog turtle is endangered in the United States. Only several thousand survive. They live in small areas of wetland like this one. Scott Smith has worked with bog turtles for 17 years. This one has had a chronic problem with an ear infection. This male turtle was first found 12 years ago. The turtle weighs 130 grams. The radio equipment on his back weighs only seven grams. It helps scientists study his health, behavior, and resting places. Smith says bog turtles spend a lot of time digging down in the dirt, opening up small spaces for other animals to use. Julie Slakem works for the United States Fish and Wildlife Service. A part of the issue was loss of habitat, but another part of the issue where people were actually going in the wetlands, taking the turtles and selling them illegally. Scott eggs. Smith says other threats are a slow reproductive process and animals that eat turtle eggs. Land development and changes in waterways have affected the environment of bog turtles. Recently, environmental groups and local governments joined together to protect the creatures. Bill Branch is a biologist with Maryland's Highway Administration. He says state officials plan to build a road in this area many years ago, but that was before bog turtles were discovered here. After the discovery, officials decided to move the road project. The road is now being built on the other side of the hill. There are also efforts to rebuild the turtle's environment. Farm animals are now clearing invasive plants from the area. Officials are avoiding chemicals or machines that could threaten the turtles. I'm Doug Johnson.